Hello everyone, this is uh I'm see my mic is on. Okay. This is your boy D down on the Shifty channel and welcome to a brand new Gmod tutorial. So uh this is more of end zombies related, but you can obviously do in like your own server or something in the like sandbox. I'm gonna show you how to modify TFA weapons, specifically COD ones, because they're way more easier. But you should be able to do them in pretty much anything. So let me show you an example. So I'm currently running my modified pack right now, not public yet. And <clears throat> my modified pack modified the 191145, which is only seven damage, and this COD 4M14 only has eight rounds. Uh, the default in the workshop add-on is 20, and I thought I'd modify it to more like the Black Ops 1 slash 2 than 14. So, I think you guys know. So, uh, I'm gonna show you guys how you can do that. First of all, you're gonna have to subscribe to a workshop add-on, add add of course. So, I gotta go and create a mode to save, just in case. Uh, <clears throat> so, let's go ahead and quit. And I'll show you guys on how you can do this. So, ignore that. So, first of all, we're gonna go to Gary's Mod. Go to Properties, Local Files, Browse Local Files. Go to Gary's Mod, Add-ons, and... <clears throat> So, you usually won't get folders by oh, default, so, yeah. Instead, you would usually get GMA oh. files. So, first of all, I recommend, so when you double click on it, when you double click on GMA, it would say, open another, how do I explain it? Oh, use another app to open this, and you're going to have to hit browse, go to Gary's Mod, bin, and scroll down until you get gmad.exe <coughs> and once you've done that go back to Gary's mod go to Gary's mod add-ons and okay so let's say uh... hmm mmm let's say I want to get rid of I mean, let's say I want to go ahead and modify the 725 in Modern Warfare, you know. So we're going to go to Lua, the weapons, and Olympia, well, it'll be different for you. And you can either do Notepad++ or normal Notepad. For this video, Notepad++ will do. And... <coughs> So, actually, you know what, just to make this easier, I'm just going to run normal notepad. So, swap offer, fleshy mammal, I was reload, purpose, I was reloading. I never done this, but I never done this weapon before, but whatever. View model flip, false. So, uh, we don't really care about this stuff. Use hands, sure. You know, you can do all this if you want, I don't care. But the part that we want is damage damage and clip size. So <clears throat> So let's say for some reason I make the Olympia do the best damage because you know that this is the new Modern Warfare, so yeah. Number of shots, no take ammo. Clip size, you know what, just for fun, let's make it 10. Buckshot, default clip, 20, 20 plus 4. RPM, now, see we changed the damage, and we changed the clip size. So, and of course you can change the other stuff if you want. Uh, I'm not going to go for it though. So, once you've done that, hit save, and we're going to launch Gmod. 64 bit. Here we go. <clears throat> so, once you load into Gmod, it's pretty quick for me. So, 
<coughs> We're gonna start a new game. We're just gonna be in sandbox, cause this will work fine in sandbox. So you know, just to make this fitting, let's play the new shipment. Jeez. <coughs> so, while this is loading, I think it's a good time to say if you guys think this was helpful and hopefully it works, and uh, just give me a subscribe for upcoming tutorials because I might do more uh, probably often. I don't know. <coughs> So, yeah. And again, this will apply to end zombies, of course, since, you know, it's, it's, a, it's a Gmod weapon, ah! so. Yeah. Just gotta. Oh, okay, Origin. Uh, <laughs> hold on, guys. Um, task bar, can you please go away? <sighs> you guys just might as well speed it up. So, yeah. Alright, so, once you are in, just get the weapon out, let's see, where is it? Alright, we'll wait for this, alright, there we go, 10, and <coughs> 10,000 damage, and 10, look at that recoil, <laughs> So it works, so that's nice. I like to know that that's weird. <clears throat> I don't know how to modify pack weapons right now. I'm gonna have to ask my friends and I'll do a video on that as well. So it worked. And I'll feel like going on in zombies. So, since this thing does 10,000 damage, and this thing can pretty much kill Father Gregory in one shot. Yep. And probably G Man as well. I'm sure. I don't know. But let's find out. Uh, humans. Look at that. It even kills G Man. Wait, is that a splash damage? Oh. Okay. That's. Oh, yeah. Also, you can change the recoil. So if I want to. Um. <sighs> Right now, I I can guarantee right now I can change the recoil to literally none, <coughs> and I'll have a powerful shotgun. So I don't know if I changed it to range, but just for fun, <laughs> that range though basically debauched me. So uh, yeah, that's about it, guys. Thank you guys for watching. And again, every add-on is different, so you may not get damage, but, you know, just try different add-ons, you know? <coughs> and it'll probably work. So, bye-bye.